Hi everyone! Today I'm having a chat with you about my laundry routine, which sounds a little bit random, but it's a big part of family life. And I thought I would show share with you how I organise our laundry. Like, laundry is my job in the house, so it's completely up to me to sort of organise it all. And because I work from home, that sort of makes sense, as I can sort of put the laundry on during the day and things like that. So. I've got three children, two adults, three children, and a dog, and two cats, and it's quite a lot of washing. So I just thought I'd share with you how exactly I manage that. So the kids upstairs, they don't have laundry baskets in their room, because I found that they sort of didn't really use them. I think they're probably a little bit young still. So they just, I put their la dirty laundry in a pile in the mornings upstairs, and I bring it downstairs to our bedroom, where we've got a big laundry basket, which our clothes and then all of their clothes come into. So here's me showing you our dirty laundry. This is the laundry basket I'm talking about. As you can see, it's really full. It gets that full sort of every day, pretty much. And then, so in the mornings then, I take that downstairs to the utility room, or as I call it, the laundry room, to sort out. Right, so downstairs in here is what I call my laundry room. It's a bit of a messy utility room, but we've got a tumble dryer and a washing machine. And I've got these um, laundry tubs. They're from Ikea, and there's they're two separate ones, and there's two uh, compartments in each. So I use this one for whites, this one for like uh, darks, this one for colours, and this one for towels. So I bring this big basket of laundry down and then I sort it into the different sections. So I do that every morning. So now that's all sorted into its baskets, I basically just choose whichever has got the most washing in it to start off. So I think I'm going to do towels today. Um, we have a variety of different coloured towels so I split this again into sort of lighter coloured towels and darker coloured towels and then I'll put them in the wash. So I've got a little puppy helping me today. So these are the sort of lighter coloured towels. Try not to put the dog in the wash. <laughs> She's got one of the... <laughs> okay. The washing machine I have uh, pre-measures all the liquids so I don't need to put any of that in and I've just set it for 60 degrees and there we are right then this basket I leave out here because I put anything that needs to go on a dryer upstairs and I empty the drying that's been in the tumble dryer overnight empty that all into a basket so the washing that has been dried in the tumble dryer I put in this basket just by the radiator um just waiting to be ironed I don't even fold it because I know I'm going to iron it but if I didn't have time to iron I would be I would have folded that so when the towels are finished in there I'll transfer them to the tumble dryer and put another load of washing on as I said I work from home so I'll hear this beep in two hours and come down and swap it all over and that's just how the cycle of washing will work today. I also have like a little routine, I have to clean the dog's bedding every day so that sort of gets done at some point during the day when the washing machine is like a bit empty and other things I wash regularly are is the bedding, I always do the bedding on Sunday so that it gets stripped and washed on a Sunday so that's four beds so that just all gets done on Sunday when we're home to sort of I can pop it in and out of the washer and dryer again. So I do iron everything. I am a bit of a freak about ironing, I guess. I do like things to be ironed. I don't iron things that don't need to be ironed, but I do iron probably a lot more than other people do. So I tend to do the ironing every evening and then I bring it upstairs. I put it all into piles um, as I'm ironing it. So it goes into whosoever clothes it is. And then I just take it up to their rooms. And then I put it away sort of throughout the day when I've just when I happen to be in that room and I've got a bit of time. So I do it all, put it in their piles, put the piles in their rooms. And I guess as they get older, the kids, when their pile of laundry's in their room, they'll be able to put it away themselves. But I'll just show you here in my room. 
Here at the end of my bed, I've got this sort of unit that keeps all our bedding in and I just put our folded and ironed laundry up here and then sort of if I've got five minutes in the morning when I'm getting ready, I'll put it away or in the evening as I'm going to bed, I'll put it away. I don't tend to put it away as I'm bringing it upstairs just because there's sort of five lots of laundry, but it does sort of get put away throughout the day. So that's how I manage the laundry for our family. I hope you found this useful and you learned some tips. I'd love to hear about how you organise your laundry system. So please do leave me a comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, do tell me and give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.